John Bracamontes here with Acumen Studio. I have for you three creative ideas for your SEM strategy. So we're talking search engine marketing, paid search, pay-per-click, AdWords, remarketing. There are so many tips out there on strategy and tactics that are typical. It's the same thing regurgitated over and over, and everybody knows it, and that's great. Refresh yourself. Get out there. Learn it. Reinforce those ideas because they're the foundation. They're the building blocks. But what I'm showing you today are three creative ideas that many, most, maybe no one uses other than our agency and our clients. So we've seen this work very well for us. It's works, worked and works very well for the people that work with us that we do this for. So let's talk about number one. Find out where else your website visitors go online. What I'm talking about is people come to your website and they visit other websites. It would be very helpful for you to know where those visitors go elsewhere. What topics interest them? What websites do they frequent? Because this will allow you to gain some intelligence about your customers and potentially where you can spend advertising elsewhere. So you might find that 90% of the visitors that come to your site go to some other topically relevant website. So you're going to invest and advertise with that company or partner or cooperate with them in some in some way, right? So great user intelligence. How are you going to do this? You're going to use remarketing. So your site gets visitors. Use the AdWords remarketing tag. Place that on your website. And what it's going to allow you to do is collect those people as an audience. You're going to be able to advertise to them. Now, in this scenario, we want to put ads out that we hope they don't click on. So you're going to make something that's just something that they won't click on. You don't want them to. Because all you're going to do is go into your AdWords uh, campaigns, display, network, and look at the placements tab, and you're going to pull up that report to see where they've been. This is user intelligence. You are solely looking to see where the ads were showing up, getting that list of URLs and the number of times it was served from AdWords. You're welcome. Do it. Number two, bid on terms that won't immediately convert. So this is typical to content marketing strategies. You've got top and middle and bottom of the funnel content. Typically, when you work in paid search, SEM, you work on the bottom of the funnel terms, things that will convert quickly. That's great, and you need to be doing it. But you can also do a couple different things here. Getting at those higher level or middle of the funnel terms, it's going to bring people into the funnel, let you capture information from them in multiple ways, get them an email address, pixeling them to retarget. You'll be able to get back at them on social media. You get back to them through email if you get them to give their email up. So all those things are ways that are cost effective and getting in front of them all over the place, different channels. Communicate, communicate, be there, be visible. So here we go, the normal way. A term you bid on, best price plaid scarf. You send them to your low price plaid scarf page and you get them to convert and buy, right? No duh. This is the way we do it. But the way I'm talking about, the new way. Let's talk about a term, how to choose what type of scarf to buy. Bid on that. Now you're going to send them to an informational page that explains what type of scarves exist, what their use is, what people, you know, what the style's all about, what their history is. Get Inform them. So you get them to read, subscribe, you can get back out to them, but you're educating them and it sticks with it. But it can also give you a boost in SEO visibility because now these bloggers, these people that are looking for it might link back to this content because it was so useful to them. So now you have a link back to your site. Boom. Number two, you're welcome. Middle of the funnel, top of the funnel terms, bid on them. Number three, tell people not to click on your ad. Refer psychology. It's simple. It stands out. What do you want to do when someone tells you not to do something? You want to do what they told you not to do. So try running ads that literally say things like, do not click on this ad. Only savvy people, savvy business people click on this ad. It might not be for you, so don't do it. This is something where you, let's say you know the audience. You can use in remarketing uh, the email list and AdWords. You can get to a known audience. So all you need to do is get them to click. There's no qualifier. This is the qualifier. Get them to click. So you're welcome. Enjoy. Read through this. These tactics are solid. John Bracamontes, Acumen Studio.